but we want to talk about how it could go down in history compared to other presidential inaugurations. Angela Fritz joins us live from Washington, D.C. She's the deputy weather editor of the Capitol Weather Gang. So let's start off talking about what's going to set Donald Trump's inauguration weather-wise different than the others. Well, traditionally, I mean, historically, when we look back, things have been pretty cold on Inauguration Day. Trump is actually going to kind of, he gets pretty lucky. Tomorrow, we're expecting temperatures highs around 50 degrees. The unlucky part, of course, is that we're also expecting yeah. rain. And although that's probably not going to affect him very much, the crowds will exactly. definitely need to prepare for that. Okay, so let's talk about the warmest and the coldest. What I think is most interesting about this is one president holds both those records. Yes, it's very interesting. President Reagan had both the coldest and the warmest inauguration. Of course, the coldest had to be held indoors because it was so cold. Mm -hmm. uh, and so <laughs> that is unfortunate for him. Although, you know, in 1981, the weather kind of made it up to him. <laughs> yeah, it's nice and cozy, a little more of an intimate setting there. Um, yes. So at noon, <laughs> when Trump raises his right hand, Temperature is going to be, you know, uh, typically around 37 with a slight wind chill. So let's go back in time and see are Democrats or Republicans luckier when it comes to the weather draw? Oh, it's Republicans, but only by a hair. And I have to be honest, I'm not even sure that's statistically significant. <laughs> yeah, I know. I mean, look at the difference here. Democrats, you know, they average 33.6, Republicans 39.3. So let's talk about the chance of rain, though, on, on Inauguration Day and how high that chance is. I mean, I would have to say that there is... I am so confident that it is going to rain tomorrow at some point. Um, the start time is still in question, mm -hmm. but I would imagine that, you know, between noon and three, it is probably going to be raining. All right. Well, uh, Andrew Foote with the Capital Weather Gang, we appreciate you joining us this morning.